It is Monday, April 8th, 2024. It's 3.09 p.m., almost 3.10 p.m. Eastern Canadian time. And this is incredible. We got these hawks or falcons flying around here. And we're about just under 20 minutes from totality for this total solar eclipse. A bit of clouds moving in, but thankfully not too thick. But you can see the ground starting to dim a bit. Here in Chambly, just south of Montreal, Canada, here's my shadow. If you look closely, I'll try to zoom in here. You can see somewhat irregularities in the shadow. Notice how it's a bit fuzzy on the left and clear on the right, more sharp on the right, fuzzy on the left. So for example, my pointing finger, now it's hard to tell because it's a field here that I'm in, but the shadows are starting to get quite interesting and the temperature is dropping. And nature is sensing something for sure. Nature knows something is off. You can't see it through the camera, but we're nearing the total eclipse, the totality phase. It is Monday, April 8th, 2024. It is now 3.14 p.m. Eastern Canadian time. We are minutes away from this total solar eclipse. I'll zoom out here, remove the glasses. Now look at the landscape, it's getting darker. It's incredible. And like I said, I'm gonna be focusing on nature focusing on animal behavior. But there was some seagulls before in the distance that were noisy since I got here about an hour or so ago and they've completely quieted down. I wanna show you guys something cool here. It's hard to see. I'm in a field by the way right now. But if I put my shadow here, look at my shadow. It sort of looks a little weird, you know what I mean? It's a little off. I'll zoom in here for a better example so you can kind of see the left side of my hand or you know the left side of the shadow of my hand is a bit blurry compared to the right side and it's kind of hard to see because the lines the lines a little bit uneven let's maybe go over here where these tree branches are look at the shadows of the tree branches how irregular they are. Kind of cool this effect. There's the landscape again. Totality is coming soon. All right, so this is my last segment before I begin filming the beginning of the total eclipse, totality. It is right now Monday, April 8th, 2024. Exactly 3.19 p.m. Eastern Canadian time and already you could see the ground is very dim it's sort of like it's hard to explain it's not like a rolling thunderstorm when it starts to obscure the clouds it's a lot different than that it's it's hard to explain but it's an eerie feeling but a beautiful feeling and the birds are still chirping for now, but it'll be very interesting to see what they do. And about seven or eight minutes from now. This is gonna be fun. Zoom into the distance, you can see the skyline. But it looks like a bit of clouds. But it's not going to really affect the totality of the eclipse. Here we go. It's almost time. We 
got a honeybee here or some kind of bee that landed on this bucket I was sitting on. Look at this. That's beautiful. Probably senses something's going on and is settling down. And it is beginning. We're two minutes away from totality. And look at this beautiful arc, this beautiful circle around the sun. That is amazing. And the landscape right now. It's getting incredibly dark. This is incredible. Wow. And we have, I think, Venus. Venus, I think, is coming out. Can we can we find Venus here? Let's let's find Venus. I think that's Venus right there. And here we go. There it is, the moment that I've been waiting for for years is here now. You can see the corona of the sun, the atmosphere of the sun. Let's take a look at the landscape. It looks like sunset. Right, looks like the sun is coming back. What a surreal moment this is in my life. Unbelievable. Wow. It's like being on an alien world. <laughs> that was incredible. We got some birds now flying around again. Incredible. Looks like a spotlight, but that's the sun. What an historical moment. And now it's gonna get brighter like a nightlight. 
slowly coming on or a street light slowly coming on what a moment that was all right guys i'm gonna wrap her up here hopefully you enjoyed that once in a lifetime moment but this has got me wanting now to chase some other total solar eclipses one day in other parts of the world. Amazing. Better look at the landscape. Slowly the normal colors are coming back. Incredible. Alright everyone, thanks for watching. Remember if you like what you see, hit the like button, subscribe, turn on your notification bells. More documenting, just like this, more documenting to come.